So before we picked up the macro lens for a moment that we're going to talk about in this video, I did some research on YouTube and one of the most poignant videos that stuck out to me was one that Taylor for a moment did about submitting a last minute film to their film festival. She used the 10x macro lens and it was just a super interesting film that you should definitely check out down there. I've linked it in the description. So I'm going to try and create a similar kind of deal today. Yo, 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 it's Joe from Photos with Friends. Today, we're here to talk solely about the Moment 10X macro lens. Let's get to it. As I told you in the intro, we're gonna create a kind of short film kind of deal to show off what this macro lens can do. The inspiration for my little short film is going to be the fact that I'm getting antsy and I haven't traveled in a while, obviously because of COVID-19. My fiance Catherine and I create a little travel diary where we paste postcards that we purchase at cool places that we go and then write the date as like a memorial to the experience. So we'll get a real interesting look of those landscapes that are plastered on the postcards and a macro level. Let's get to it. <laughs> The Moment 10X macro lens is frequently on sale, but is currently at just under $120, though the ratings and reviews are going to reflect the positive things that I have to say about it. It is worth noting that Moment lenses in general are not going to come with a rear lens cap. The Moment macro lens, as with all Moment lenses, are going to need either the M-series case or the M-series lens mount to mount your lens. I have the M-series case for my iPhone 11 Pro, Google Pixel 3a, Google Pixel 4a with 5G, and one for Catherine's iPhone XR. And I've been impressed with the sturdiness of the case and the bayonet mounting system in all of them. The macro that you're seeing today is taken on my iPhone 11 Pro, but Moment makes cases for Apple, Google, Samsung, and OnePlus devices. The Moment macro lens also comes with a removable diffuser hood for getting that perfect lighting. You're going to want to use that macro lens at a working distance of one inch. 
you'll be able to mount your Moment 10X macro lens on both the wide and tele lens on dual camera setups, but it's worth noting that you cannot mount it on the ultra wide. It also comes with a front lens cap, as I mentioned earlier, no rear lens cap, and a microfiber carrying bag. The lens is going to be made of aerospace grade metal and hand polished glass and is covered by a Moment lifetime warranty. So what we got for you. If you feel like you got value from this video, go ahead and hit the like button down there. It definitely helps photos with phones out a lot because it forces YouTube to show our videos to other people. Comment down below and let us know if you're going to pick up the Moment 10X macro lens. It is linked in the description if you're interested, and up there in the right hand corner, you'll find a link to the first episode in the Moment vs. Sandmark series where we compared the Moment 10X macro lens with the Sandmark 10X macro lens. Yeah. If you do comment something, we might shout you out at the end of the video, just like we're going to do right now. Thanks for watching, Patrick. And as always, subscribe to the channel. We're coming out with twice weekly mobile photography and filmmaking, tips, tricks, hacks, reviews, unboxings, anything that you could think of. Toodles. See you in the next one. Bye.